Uh, hello, uh, thank you for watching this video. In this video we're going to talk about uh, you have recorded a customer invoice as paid. Uh, in fact, it hasn't been paid. So how do I reverse that payment entry? So let's get started. So I'm on customer's uh, page here. Uh, so on this one, uh, Kelly Construction has $500 open invoice. So normally when you well, want to receive payment, all you do is uh, you receive payment under action here, just receive payment. Okay, and you will select your uh, uh, payment by, let's say in this case it's check, and uh, receive and close. Okay, as you can see here now, uh, the open invoice uh, uh, it's it's paid now. If we go to in here, Kelly Construction. It's paid now. There is no open balance here, and you it turns out uh, they haven't paid it. So you just want to reverse it. So all you have to do at this point, I'm on Kelly Construction customer page here. When you go there, you will see the invoice here and the payment here. Just this one. You can click any place. Just payment in here. Click that one. So it will take you to uh, receive payment screen and at the bottom you will see more, just click more and delete, they give you some message here, say yes. Now as you can see here uh, on Kelly Construction uh, customer pays, you see open invoice $500 as if uh, nothing happened now. So you have reversed the payment entry and everything looks good. So that's all we got to do, pretty easy. Uh, thanks for watching. So, uh, if you have any questions, you know you can always visit our website. It's newqbr.com. Newqbr.com. I'm on our homepage screen here. So from here you can click uh, navigate to any place you want. Like, like in here, if you click invoice, it will take you to invoice. If you click receive payment, so it'll give you all kinds of uh, uh, help. Uh, very helpful tips in here. So. Uh, uh, from here you can even sign up QuickBooks if you are a new QuickBooks user. So visit our new QBO.com and uh, you can learn a lot from here. Thank you for watching. Bye.